Hey everyone, welcome to the Tragopan YouTube channel. Today I want to introduce a couple of new products that I'm excited to show off here on the channel first and they're available on the website now so you can check it out in the link below. So I'm going to show you guys a couple of new products and then we're going to take one of them and I'm going to head up the hill for some wildlife photography using the new 3D poncho. That's the first item I want to show off, which is this one here. Nice, light, lightweight 3D poncho. Very easy to just take with you pretty much anywhere in your bag. And whenever you need some extra camouflage, throw this on, a camouflaged poncho, and you're ready to go. It's very lightweight and folds up incredibly small so you can take it with you wherever you go. There's many ways to use this, just to hang up and basically create yourself a little bit of a, of a kind of a camouflaged shelter or a camouflaged hide to be behind. So you could tie this up to a tree or something like that, sit behind it. So a slightly different way of using this 3D poncho is as, as a bag hide. I'm sure you've seen these bag hides before. It's really handy is you use the hood as an opening for your lens and camera like that and then you just open up the back of it and get under now what's really great about this as well is the material is really it's a really nice camouflage pattern all over but if you go up close you'll be able to see, you can see through this. So, hard to spot when you're looking a little bit from a distance onto the poncho, but when you're close up and you can see through the mesh, you can see everything that's going on. So, that's the first one. I wanna show you the other one. Here's an adaptation on the Gilly blanket, which we already have available on the website. This is the 3D camel blanket. Comes, nice little carry-on pouch, like the 3D poncho, it's really lightweight, folds up very small, so you can take with you pretty much wherever you go, and it's so easy to have in your bag, it doesn't take up much space. It comes in a little camouflaged pouch as well. And see on each end, it has these little hooks, so you can wrap it around a tree, hang it from a branch or anything like that. You know, find yourself that area you want to use it, maybe, you maybe find a path that's been used regularly by deer and you want to hide up between some trees. This then is ideal. And you can use the hooks that's on here. Hook it on a branch. And then take this to the next, next tree, tighten it. And obviously there are loads of different ways of using the blanket. You can lie on the ground and just throw it over yourself. And what's really good about it is that it's got this it kind of camouflage, kind of what makes it 3D, I suppose. Um, it's these kind of little bits sticking out on one side, but on the other side, it's quite smooth. So it doesn't hook up to it, you know, it doesn't get in the way or hook on to different things that you might be wearing or anything like that. It's very easy to, you, know, you could just wrap this around yourself as well. To use to hide. So there you have it, that's the new items that you can find on the Tragopan website. Uh, that's the 3D, 3D poncho and the 3D camo blanket. Stay tuned because tomorrow morning I'm going to be taking this 3D poncho with me 
up the hills to photograph some mountain hares. If you're in the US or Canada, check out photographyblinds.com. For Europe and the rest of the world, check out tragopan-shop.com. And don't forget, we have a little discount code below. You can use that when you're in the shop. And feel free to, you know, take a photo in the field, from the field of your wildlife photos and from, you know, using our products and share them on social media. On Facebook, you can tag us at Tragopan Team. For Instagram, use the hashtags Tragopan Photo and tag us at Tragopan Photo. We reshare wildlife photos and photos of you guys using the equipment in the field. So please do that. We happily share it in our stories and on our posts. So now I'm just going to go to bed. I have an early start. I'm going to climb this hill at probably about four o'clock in the morning to be up there, to be up top in time for sunrise. So I'll see you tomorrow morning. What a walk up. Probably took me an hour and a half to get up. The sun has just come up behind me on the horizon here now. Absolutely stunning morning. There's not a cloud in the sky. And I've already seen a good few mountain hairs up here. But they're really getting away from me quickly. And that's what I noticed last time I was up here as well. Uh, I was just walking up here then, kind of doing a bit of a wreck here, just a, just a bit of a hill walk. But um, even trying just a little bit, I didn't put much effort in to get close to the mountain hairs, but they just ran away immediately. This camouflage pattern actually works quite well. The vegetation here. here I'll just leave my bag I'll start crawling a bit closer um, they're just sitting upright which means they're a bit exposed probably feel a bit more threatened so they run away immediately it might take a while to get close I'm just gonna have to have patience
I would love to stay up here for hours more, but back to this, the vegetation here was so wet. I'm pretty soaked and I'm really cold because the wind is picking up. So I think I'm gonna have to get off this. I think I'm gonna have to get off this hill now. Call it for today. But I've absolutely loved this. This was so much fun. And this is absolutely, this is the best, best time I've had with uh, my own hairs before. So happy that you guys could uh, join me with this little adventure this morning. And you guys can pick up the new Tragopan 3D poncho and 3D blanket on the website. So check that out. So if you liked this video, be sure to subscribe, hit that bell to be notified so you can keep keep up with the, the monthly content that we come out with on YouTube where I take Tragopan gear like this and hides and all the kind of cool stuff we sell on the websites, take them out into the field for wildlife photography. If you haven't seen it in my channel before, uh, my name is Espen. I have a wildlife, I have a channel on wildlife photography as well, so I'll put a link to that in case you want to check out more of those kind of wildlife photography vlogs. So thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you next time.